Who's that guy? I don't know, a tourist. It's Wesley! Guys, I am back with Wesley. We are we're in the Yukon now. <laughs> Wesley's a Yukon man. We're going for walleye in the Yukon. <laughs> Guys, we're uh, fishing local tonight. We're gonna fill some walleye tags. I have some Class B walleye tags. Do I show all this in the video where we drive on? Oh my gosh! Look at the traffic. <laughs> Step one. Wake up, brother. Gonna rise with the sun. Step two. Get some good, some food in you. Step three. You grow hard about what you wanna be. Step four. Okay, guys, we got the drone. We're gonna do some drone footage. Two walleye. I got two tags. We'll show you how the tags work later because Saskatchewan, Manitoba do not have tagging programs or tags for walleye. I don't think. Is that right? Does Manitoba have tags for fish? I don't know. Never caught a fish. Guys, before. comment below if Manitoba has any kind of tags so you can keep fish. But I think it's just Alberta because Alberta has way too many people fishing. Okay, we're gonna get get at drilling some holes here and get into our spot. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. 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 Wake up. Well, I think my rattle bait might be too big for the walleye here. You got a knife or anything on you? There's scissors in the bottom of the... Okay, I got six pound test outside I'm gonna use. I'll go out this way. Yeah, you use your door. <laughs> but I like using your door, Wesley. My door is the wind side door. Oh, oh, John, John, you on? Oh, we're videotaping. You got your... On. Going. Are you on? Yeah. <laughs> come, come Sherpa, come get my fish. Yeah, 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 yeah. Make sure you don't break my off. I got the crankbait on. Black St. Anne. Oh, it's coming in backwards. Hold on, hold on, hold on. He's landing for you. Oh no, what if he gets away? Well, don't lose him. He's got my good hook in his mouth. <sighs> oh, easy, easy on the <laughs> Okay, guys. Mostly's caught the first fish. Oh, oh, just quality pike right here. That's a lax St. Anne pike for sure. What is happening here? We have too many hooks. There we there go. go. Oh. The easy on my line. <laughs> you have to retie. You have a $250 rod from G. Loomis. And what did you just catch? Ah, uh, pretty big pike. I would say at least probably pushing 30 pounds. <laughs> <laughs> you know what they say, the camera adds 10 pounds. Yeah, good stuff. I haven't even got a rod in. Do you know why I like our fishing trips? Because wow. it's full of chaos. Uh. You just you didn't have that pike. I'd seen him come out of the live scope, and I was like, oh, this is a big pike. Um, are you going to lay your minnow on bottom or just suspend it touching bottom? I'll probably put it up like four inches off bottom. It seems like this lake. Um, well, I caught some laying on bottom too. Good job, Wesley, on the first fish. Well, you, of course it was me. Do you count that? Do you count that as a fish? It's Wesley won, Sean. Nothing. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. Uh -huh. Here's what's gonna be on my jaw jacker. Just a treble and a minnow, four inches off bottom. Wesley's got one on instantly. Why do I have to help you again? I haven't even got a line in. Is this gonna be Wesley, Wesley's fishing adventures? It's a bourbon, I think. You think so? Feels funny, not fighting like a pike. Now it's fighting like a pike. It's even bigger than my last one. <laughs> okay, have fun with that. We're gonna get mine out here. I wanna go for a walleye. The goal today, guys. Two, you need a minnow? Two class B walleyes. And what's class B? 43 centimeters to 50 centimeters like this guy. Is he, is he 43 to 50? What if I hold him really close to the camera? There's your minnow. Hey, hey don't let him eat it. Good job, Wesley. Wesley, negative two. I almost took a fishing rod in the eye setting up my jaw jacker. And I was like, wait, why is the trigger going off? <laughs> Wesley, negative two. Sean zero. Every day, later die, not okay, all I
I wish I could do that. Mine unclip and they're hard to unclip. Oh, here we go. Here comes a fish on me. On you. It's a pike though. No, it looks like a walleye. Oh. oh no, it's a walleye. It is a walleye, little guy. Smallest walleye. Oh boy, he looked really big on camera. Smallest walleye ever. Measure it for the people, is he slot size? It's okay. 13 inch. Well, that's, uh, slot size is in centimeters. What's that this? is a perfect fish. Class you know why? Because Wesley hasn't caught a walleye today. That's why it's a perfect fish. My fish is looking for me. Mine's coming up. Just don't even hesitate. Just eat it, buddy. Eat it. Oh, he touched me. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, he's coming. Here he comes. Yep, there we go. Oh, it's tiny again. Maybe it's a perch. Yeah, lots of little ones. That's even smaller. Okay, I got a fish all over me. <laughs> Do we even consider those two walleyes fish? So far, we're like oh for oh. We haven't even landed a decent fish. Well, I mean, also look where we're fishing. Maxine Ann. Don't tell the people. I thought we were supposed to call this Lac St. Anne filling walleye tanks. This is how to help people catch walleye at Lac St. Anne. Yeah, by catching... How not to catch walleye at Lac St. Anne. By catching 7 inch and 13 inch walleye. That's all we've caught. Bigger one's local, hey? Oh, here we go. Oh, here we go. That's a bigger fish. They stomp on the ice. Oh, he's turning. What is he doing? Oh, that's a walleye for sure. Looks like a, oh, it looks like a pike, eh? It is a pike for sure. What if he bites me and snaps me off? Well, then I would reel in. You think that's a pike? What if it's a monster walleye? No, I know it's a pike. Oh, he bit me. Yeah, that's a pike for sure. I got him, guys. Don't worry. <laughs> He'll bite again. Oh, I was oh. Totally he's just him. going crazy for it. Oh, he's going for yours now. Well, I don't have a minnow on He's still it. He's going to hit it. Why is he going to bite it? I really don't want to catch this pike with my, my hook. I'm going to get it away from okay, him. Well, I'm going to catch him. Sorry. Oh, look at him. He's just lightning fast. He's going to come in storming and hit my hook. Oh, here he comes. Just pull yours away. There. Got him? Did you get the hook set? Did you get the hook set? No, I got the hook set. That's all that matters. It's a hook <laughs> set. It's a huge walleye. We're going to measure this walleye, guys. He's going to be... He looked really big on the live scope, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> okay. Quality fish. <laughs> you got our heater all wet. Then we're on another fiasco like uh, Slave Lake. Should we tell the viewers what happened in Slave Lake? No. Wesley was getting a tip up outside. And what did you have? A G Loomis IMX Pro ice fishing rod? Yep. On a Stratic? With a Stratic. With a Stratic. And he left it in the shack. Hook in the water. And what did you catch outside that made you lose that rod? A bike. And then I go in the shack tell Wesley I'm going to fish in the shack. He's like, just be careful, my rod's in there. No, no fishy rod. Fishy rod was gone. And Wesley was sad. And I was sad for him. Because it was a G. Loomis rod. Oh, Sean, you got a fish on you. Oh, man, that's a walleye too. Two fish on you. That's a pike. Oh no, that's a walleye. The pike ate it. Oh. The pike ate it. There was a walleye looking at you, and then the pike came in and ate it. I seen that. Two fish. It's almost an insult for you. It is an insult. You're, you're making this dramatic. It's a new diesel reel. It's very dramatic. Oh, it's actually a decent sized pike. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no, my hook's gone. <laughs> Pull away and let him, let me catch him. Oh, he is coming to me. He is going right to you. Oh, oh yeah. 
and he just swam right by us. He did. He says, I don't even care. About you know what? That might be a whitefish. You think so? Yeah. They'll just swim right by in this lake, right? There's no way a pike missed both of us. I don't even remember how to catch a walleye. Yeah. <laughs> You're keeping. No, not, okay, not, not quite, not quite though. Oh, there's two fish. This fish is still on me. That's the biggest one so far today. Can I use this guy for bait? Good job, Wesley. Show him to the camera. Oh, there's two fish down there. Don't come down yet. I'm coming. No, don't come down. There's two fish. I just scared one off. It looks, feels like it's a walleye. It's not gonna be good. That's okay. Here, clean that out. Oh yeah, that's a walleye for sure. Come on, be a class B. Oh yeah! Here, hold that for me. <laughs> Thanks, Wesley. Class B walleye. There's our target species right there, you guys. Treble hook. Just a split shot and just either lay it on bottom or right off, right off bottom. He's gonna be 45 centimeters. 48. Perfect size fish. There's my keeper. I'm gonna go get the tags and we tag them. You hooked up? No, I just get back in the tent. Hmm. Okay guys, that's what you gotta do. Kill him right away and tag him. I'm allowed two walleye. Class B is 43 to 50 centimeters. And this guy is 48 centimeters. So that's number one for the evening. good person for uh, get stick in my hands and for the pike. Where's the walleye? Oh, 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 what's oh, happening? Yeah. Oh, he touched me and I missed him. As I'm switching the GoPro battery, he's back. He's gonna hit you again. Oh, he's all over you. Yeah. Oh, Dude. micro. Just a baby. What's with these small ones? Hold on a second. I gotta get a picture. Is it though? I feel like you catch small fish all the time. Go down, little guy. The small ones, hey? Oh, here we go. Oh, it's happening again. Oh, no. He just darted at me. Oh, he's gonna come again. Here he so. comes. Oh, boy. A little bit better. Nope. This is definitely not better. Micro so many here. We've caught like five of them. I just made that guy do a backflip in the hole. Guess I better tighten my drag. Have we talked about Wesley leaving to Whitehorse? No. How many times have I talked about that? Mm, probably too many times. In every one of my videos? Where'd all the fishies go? I know, hey? Usually when the sun starts going down, it lights out. It hasn't been lights out. Well, guys, we are packing up. Quick fish here with Wesley. We won't be able to fish with him for... Years now. Years. Unless he comes to the Yukon. Maybe I'll do some videotaping in the summer with Wesley in the Yukon. For in canoe. For some in canoe. Oh, that would be crazy. But yeah. Thanks for watching. I'll do a little quick video here for you guys about uh, local fishing here in Edmonton. And uh, thanks for joining.